Good day, YouTube. I hope you're all having a great day. Welcome to the fourth episode of our how to series for Football Manager 22. Today, I will be showing you how to get the pre game editor for Game Pass users. If you wish to watch more videos like this one or further content on Football Manager, FIFA, or Hattrick, then I would highly recommend you to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any future videos. Right, let's jump right in. Firstly, I'm going to take you through the ways I tried really really tried to get this editor working good news is we do i will take you through those steps at the end of the video so to understand what went wrong and you may be in the same situation as me is my football manager 22 is saved on d drive windows is c drive as it always has been defaulted and also my any apps from microsoft store they install on c drive so i have an issue of c drive d drive I thought, you know what, I will try and move the app to D Drive. That was fun in games, but actually all you had to do is go into store, click on it and move the app, which I'll show you in a minute. It was that simple. It still didn't work. Still get up a black screen. As you, you see some footage in the background playing really quickly. It's just some clips of what I was doing. Yep, so a black screen comes up one second and beep, gone. What was going on here? They're both on the same drive. They wasn't working on C and D Drive. I saw someone recommend putting them on the same drive, but nothing. Thinking, oh God, what is going on? So then I thought maybe it's something to do with its installation into that drive that I reinstalled it, but reinstalled it directly into D drive, the app. Nope, didn't work. And then I thought, you know what? There's only one other way to do it. And that is uninstall the game, uninstall the app and start again. But this time, Install them both on C drive and see if that works. It worked and here are the steps. Step one is simple. Deinstall Football Manager from the Game Pass. And then what you will need to do is open the Game Pass app, go to settings and go to general. And here it is, game store options. So within this option, I had it defaulted at D drive. You want to select C drive. Once it's installed, you can always change this location and then close and then find Football Manager and install. You want to load up Microsoft Store. You can find Microsoft Store, either type it in your search or find it in your start menu. And then you want to write Football Manager Editor and then click on the editor. Once that's opened, you want to press install. At the moment I've got open because I've already got it installed, but this will say install. Once it's installed, press open and it should work. We'll do that in a second because I just want to show you a couple more things. If by any chance your Microsoft Store apps are still saving to D drive, whereas you need it on C drive, what you can do is go into add and remove. Again, do it in the search bar down at the bottom here. Then go to the search bit, write an editor, and there's editor 22. Click on that and then you've got look, a move option. I've currently got it installed on C drive. You can even move it to any drive you want. And then you press move and it will do that. But we need it on C drive. The game's on C drive, the app is on C drive. Now going back to the store, we can now open the app. And hey presto, here it is. We don't get a black screen for three seconds, we actually get the editor. And then you can go full screen and work on the editor like you want. Whatever it might be, you might be doing some challenges, you might just want to cheat the crap out of it, or you maybe you just don't want to pay for $4.99 for the in-game editor and you would prefer to use this. I'm going to be using this for some challenges and setting up for some future video content. Again, if you don't want to miss that, please subscribe. 